We just launched into a table at Mahjong time. Here come the tiles. If you're new to Mahjong, look for links in the video description below. That way you can learn the fundamentals. Also, download this player reference so you can follow along. If you are new to playing the game, you probably haven't played at Mahjong time yet. Look for my email in the video description below. I can send you a 30-day VIP code. So we have mixed suits here. Let's discard seven bam. Seven bamboo. We'll get rid of isolated tiles and go Nine for the quickest bamboo. win possible. This is a zero point so table. Good. So chicken hands allowed. That means no Let's value win. in your hand. Here we do have two Eight pair. Bamboo. Pair of east, pair of sevens. One dot. And then we have child potential with a 1, 2, one and the 8, 9. So we'll just get one rid of three. isolated tiles. We'll get rid of the 2 dot. Two dots. We have Chow Potential with a 4, 5 now. Chow is 3 in a three sequence. Dragon. Pung is 3 of a kind. Red Dragon. Pung. Okay, that'll be a good discard green next. Dragon. There's only 4 of every tile. There's a 1, 2, 3 Chow now. South Wind. We have potential for an all-chow no, hand, don't. which actually has Nine value. Dragon. One point. There's a six, seven, eight. Let's go ahead and discard the one bam. One bamboo. We're one away from ready on all-chow. All, chow, all three in a sequence. But we're going to pung. Pung. Because that also is a point. You can get a... Six. Oops. Dots. I made a mistake. I intended Nine to dots. keep the six and discard the seven. This game is very forgiving. If you make a mistake, it's okay. You can recover. Two we have bamboos. three potential chows. Before, hmm. we had a chow already in hand, but One I discarded bamboo. that six dot. Maybe what we could do is use nine the seven as a pair and use the eight, nine, and four, three five as our chow. Is. We already have a one, two, three chow, so we don't need that three crack. There's a potential, or there is a chow now. We'll discard the eight dot, and now eight we're dots. ready to win on a seven crack. Hmm. So in this case, that mistake in discarding the six dot was fine because we had no pair. Seven characters. And there's our win, Mahjong. Mahjong. So we have no flowers and a pung of the wind of the round. Two, two. Oh, no flowers, pung of the wind of the round, and it is our seat. We're in East seat. So we ended up with three fawn. Four blocks and a pair. Three in a sequence is called a chow. Three of a kind is called a pung. Four of a kind is called a kong. You need four blocks and a pair. In a nutshell, that's how you play the game. Pick and discard. You can claim a discard from any player to complete a three of a kind, the pung or the kong, if you have all four. For the chow, you can only claim a discard from the player on your left, otherwise you have to draw the tile. So the goal is to get four blocks and a pair of anything, especially if you're playing at a zero point table, chicken hand table. In this case, we had three, three fawn. And incidentally, a fawn is a scoring element. Each fawn has a value. So for the three fawn in this particular hand, they all had only one point. I hope you learned something about Hong Kong Mahjong. If you want to know more, look for links in the video description below. And then download this player reference. Also, don't forget to send me an email so you can come and play. I can send you that 30-day VIP code. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos. And you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next strategy theory for Hong Kong Mahjong, may all your picks be keepers.